What's up, Solicit Nation? It's your girl, Nikki, and I'm back with another Unsolicited Truth Reaction. Hello, if you're new, welcome back. If you're not, if you enjoy the content, please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe down below so we can keep this party going. And please, guys, continue to watch the ads and continue to hit the thanks button because it really does help me to continue to do this for you guys full time. Now, I didn't realize that this video, there must be some kind of hidden gem. It better be. <laughs> There must be some kind of hidden gem in this video because y'all have really been on me to react to this video. I thought it was basically just like some kind of like vlog style thing or whatever. But, um, and so I didn't think it was going to be a big deal if I didn't react to it. But y'all have really been on me to react to this video. So, between the people in my IG DMs and the people in the comments on YouTube, I am giving you guys this reaction. So, with that being said, this one was highly requested, surprisingly highly, highly requested, but I'm going to go ahead and give you guys what you want. So, with that being said, this is the end. Moving out of LA, Easy X Natalie. <gasps> Let's get straight to the video. You ready to tell them? <sighs> Slicing it. They ain't going nowhere. We should tell them. You know, this is my hometown. It's my if they move out to LA, if they're moving out of LA, then I feel like they're moving out of like. They're not moving. I don't feel like they're moving out of the state. I'm just putting my two cents in now before they say they say, say their piece. I feel like they're staying in the state. They're just moving out of LA. Or they could be moving to Miami. I mean, that would be the other option because I know Easy is very fond of Miami right now. But I don't know. We'll see. Let's see what they say. Where I'm from, but I think it's time, y'all. I think it's really time for us to get the step in. I still don't believe it. Easy gang, what's up? I'm a little depressed right now. Mm. Not depressed, but just going through it. So, pretty much my car got towed. Yeah, the business, and it also says false advertising that you guys are closed Saturday through Sunday. So the fact that we didn't get the car on a Saturday through Sunday is just like, yeah. Exactly. So appointment only. Bro, I'm not going to hold you. And shout out to all the tow truck drivers out there because everybody doing a job that somebody else don't want to do. However, a comma, I have never, ever had a good experience with a tow truck, tow truck company. It's like by design, everybody that works for a tow truck company, whether they be the people that's at the desk answering the phones or the people or the actual tow truck driver, it seems like everybody in the tow truck business is an asshole. Now, granted, they do have to deal with some hostile people in situations where, especially when they're doing repos and stuff like that. I, they done had guns pulled on them. They people done trying to fight it. I get that. I get that. But it just seems like inherently, bro, like, why is the people that, I get that for the tow truck drivers themselves, maybe, but why are the people at the office mad too? <laughs> Cause, well, I mean, I guess they catching the phone. Look, customer service is customer service. You're going to always have bad customers. You're always going to have customers that's going to really get under your skin. That's going to try to test your strength and love in the Lord. You know what I'm saying? And love and humanity. But that's the reason why you're doing the job and they're not. It's because you should have a level of maturity and a level of self-control that even when somebody goes low, you don't go low with them. You know what I'm saying? So for me, I, just, I, I, I feel easy frustration without even knowing the whole context of the situation just because I have never had a good experience with a tow truck company ever, bro. So you're charging me, but because you guys are closed on a Saturday through that's Sunday. A make, make it make sense. The reason why it's super annoying, Easy Gang, is because literally they just started to reinforce like parking where if you're parking in the guest parking spot you literally have to get a guest pass like like don't reinforce that now you know what i'm saying after, all after this time. a whole year of you living there you yeah. never had that you know what i'm saying so they pretty I feel much like somebody told might say something. Guest park i feel like somebody might have said something because if you've been doing that for a year and then all of a sudden they take notice Somebody says something. That's the only reason why they do stuff like that in apartment complexes, bro. Somebody out there watching y'all and snitching. First of all, I'm on her leave. Give me a fucking parking spot. Ooh. Make it make sense. I know, that's right. That's right. Oh, that's right. Easy did say that in the last in a, uh, another video. Her name is on the lease. So if her name is on the lease, why can't she get her own damn parking space? I know, that's right. <laughs> why am I still parking and guessing in the first place? You feel me? You feel me, baby? <laughs> You feel me? But yeah. Anyway, let me give y'all a little bit of energy. But I'm a real human, and I'm just like, what are they? Bob the Builder head. <laughs> Bob the Builder head. <laughs> um, yeah. So we're about to get some. We're doing this raw vegan diet. Y'all already know. It's a cleanse. It's, it's a cleanse. I mean, it's a cleanse, not a diet. But we're eating raw vegan, and we finally found a spot that oh actually is good. Seven. You're on day seven. Now, I, I'm on. Oh, this is when day. they were doing that vegan cleanse right before her, uh, to prepare her for, you know, to lose weight so that she could prepare her body for her surgery. This was when they were still in the, the throes of doing it. This was uh first week. How long was it, y'all? What did Easy say? How long hey, was it? God tells me. <laughs> I cheated. 
Hey, this is hard. This is hard, first of all. These again, y'all know I was struggling. If you watch me on Instagram, I was struggling, struggling. So, what did you teach? At least you're doing it. At least you're doing I, it. I know you didn't have me. No, 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 no. What did you have? I just had Cheetos. That's it. <laughs> I had a little bite of steak. What do you want me to do? You're cheating. <laughs> Cheetos and a little bite of steak. Bruh. Bruh. A little bite of steak. You already know she under, uh, she's uh, under, uh, I feel like she's underestimating or under, uh, what's the word I'm trying to say? She's downplaying. I'll say it like that. She's downplaying the amount of steak. Cause if she said she had little, <laughs> she had more than a little dog. Cause at first she was like, she had steak. on me. I just went, I took a little piece. Wow. I thought you were going to say, well, I had to <laughs> No, it was cooked. Think, no, but I didn't think. I was thinking like a cooked vegan or vegetarian. Nah, it was a little steak. Really? That's a little piece. Of, yeah, piece. I said, like, can you give me a little bite? Let me. I was, I was, I was cracking. I'm proud of myself. You know what I, I had trying. to learn? What like, mean? I can't count on her to ah. keep me to be your accountability partner. Motivated or strong when it comes to stuff like this. I, that's why I didn't do it in front of you, girl. I would never do that in front of you. Girl, you brought me cauliflower. It's cauliflower to go. First of all, we were going to the movies, and I was like, okay. Okay, should we eat vegetables or should we eat popcorn? I was like, okay, let's just get cauliflower. Cauliflower is good, but it was just fried. fried I wasn't cauliflower. gonna eat either, and I didn't. That shit's still good. some nuts. She better. Yeah, cause I, that shit. This whole diet is making me nuts. Oh yeah. <laughs> so we just got our vegan shake. Ooh. Cheers, baby. Cheers. I'm not gonna lie to y'all. What? I'm not gonna hold you with some of the um uh meal plan options that I have. They are vegan options and. The, there are so many recipes, dog. You just got to be willing to do the research and put the time in in the kitchen. But there are some bomb-ass vegan uh, recipes that really will have you not out here missing uh, any dairy or um, uh, meat. And I'm and that's on God. Like, they got some stuff that you'd be surprised. You'd be like, this is not... Like, I just learned about how to use jackfruit to uh, make, like, you know shredded chicken tacos and stuff like that bro and it's good and it looks like oh and nuggets and nuggets nah. jackfruit is the truth bro i'm glad they're doing i'm glad they did this though i wonder if they're trying to keep the vegan life it's not super easy but i'm definitely looking slimmer she is uh skin's glowing 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 yeah and that's another thing y'all since I, I know I keep stopping it a lot, but since I uh, changed the way I've been eating, obviously increased my water intake. I've always been a huge water drinker, but I've even increased it the more. Um, that's one thing I will say too, is that my skin has cleared up. It's smoothed out all over my body, not even just like on my face or whatever. Honestly, it's delicious. Too. It's delicious. If you know what you're doing, yeah. you know what I'm yeah. saying? If you know where to eat at. If you like yeah, me, that's this is Evan. You know, I've been eating the goddamn shower. Just let me yeah. so, Shakes that I can eat or drink. Yeah. <laughs> this is phenomenal. This is exactly. heaven on earth. Yeah. Mm -hmm. What is this one? This is the coffee shake. Mm -hmm. Yours is a cacao. 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 <laughs> cacao. Listen. All right. I. You. Y'all know. I'm on a self discovery and self improvement. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, man. Journey. Aren't I mean, I know about her. I'll be, I'll be ready. I'll be proud about, about it. You know what I'm saying? Nah, I'll be cool. I'll be chill. But once somebody get disrespectful to my girlfriend, it's a rat. It's a rat. What is you talking about, girlfriend? Like that, my guy. Don't <laughs> <laughs> my mother. Don't disrespect my son. Right. So oh, I'm, I'm over sorry, here guys. That's so annoying. I'm so sorry. That was my food uh bell so let me go ahead and get these these joints right here y'all this is just some of the types of things that i have these joints right here are bomb these are called gluten-free bites i ain't sponsored by nobody but these are just called gluten-free bites and i think we picked them up at like wagmans or something i can't remember where we get these from i don't know where we got them from but they're literally called the gluten-free bites anyway it's chocolate this one in particular is chocolate cherry and almond and Two pieces is 110 um, is 110 calories, uh, which is basically like anywhere between 100 and 110 calories is what I do for fuelings, not meals, but fuelings. Just like when I'm in between my meals and I just want to eat something, I just want to kind of keep my metabolism going and burning fat. I just pop something like this, anything between 100 and 110 uh, calories that is on the healthy side, not just anything, you know, just like a Rice Krispie treat or something, although some people do that. Um, but these joints, you would think that two of these joints wouldn't fill you up or at least, you know, uh, satisfy your hunger in the meantime. 
they do. You know what I'm saying? So excuse me, pardon me while I eat this. You know what I'm saying? Enjoy a little pull of the blue dream right here. You know what I'm saying? I will come back with y'all in just a second. Okie dokie. Oh, back to my it. Mother. Don't disrespect my shorty. All right. So I'm over here having a tap, tap, tap easy. Like... Tap, tap, tap in these hands. Yeah. Tap, no, tap, tap, tap into your soul. Okay. <laughs> tap, tap, tap into the universe. Right. To find a oh, little shit. alignment. Because mm. she's over here ready to they told, snap. He told y'all. my car. First of all, he told my car. Mm. And they told it in your building, which I am on the lease, which means that is a parking spot that they shouldn't have told. And then we get in there trying to reason with the guy like, like, bro, okay. I was being so peaceful too. That's what she was. Thing. I don't know if y'all saw in the little clip, but I was being very peaceful. She was. I was using words like have a little compassion. Right, right. But listen. Right, you're so trying to appeal to the person's humanity. I've tried stuff like that before. Shit don't work with everybody. It works with some folks, but some people just be like, they don't have the capacity to give a <laughs> told my car just a little bit of breakdown so you guys understand they told my car from a place that i have a lease on in guest parking right they told my car right and but what they did was they were trying to charge me for five days but mind you they're closed on the weekend so you mean to tell me because you're closed your business hours i still get charged no charge me for my three days you feel me so we were trying to understand they were like oh well we i asked them i was like yo so you guys are closed on the weekend they're like yeah i'm like okay so how was i supposed to get my car they're like well if you would have called we would have answered but i'm like your business hours specifically said that you're closed you just said that you were closed so I was gonna get my car if he was close. Anyway. Right. And then I told them that I called on the weekend, which I didn't. But Gorgeous. they didn't know that. They didn't know that. They didn't know that at all. But anyway, it was a whole situation in my car being towed and bro. This is ridiculous. I don't understand how tow people can make money off of your valuable possession. You yeah. didn't buy my car. Nigga, I bought that shit. He told me an example. <laughs> Yo, easy is hot. She's mad, mad, but I get it though. I get it, bro. I've been in situations like this. I'm telling you, dog. And I've been with, I've been with people when they've been in a situation with the tow truck, and somebody had to go get the, you know what I'm saying, the blacker blacker. <laughs> you know, I, I, I wasn't the one that got the blacker blacker, but somebody had to get the blacker blacker. I had to call my big brother to go calm down my friend who went and got the black and black and like bro you gotta go and you gotta get oh you gotta i ain't putting no names out there but you gotta go and you gotta get um you gotta go get get them <laughs> you just you just gotta go get them uh and big bro did he he went and got him and uh talked him talk him down off that ledge because he was ready to black a block out you know what i'm saying everybody uh <laughs> i try to tell y'all my friends and family this ain't the same they not built like everybody else's see i couldn't i couldn't pull a prank like that you, get, you see what I'm saying? Like, there's, a, there's pranks on YouTube. It's like, oh, tow truck prank. I can't pull pranks like that. My people, they get the blicky. <laughs> they get the black and black out. You know what I'm saying? And when, they, when the black and black come, all the, I prank. And, and, and it's like you're beyond the prank part, you know? It's like you can't talk somebody down once they get the black and black out. So I just don't do stuff like that with my family. But I understand Easy's energy because that shit is hella frustrating. Like, bro, like, uh, uh, can you give some kind of uh compensation or whatever? He was like, that's like going to McDonald's and asking them, oh, can I get a quarter pounder and get a discount on it? Hold the fuck up! What'd I say, baby? I was calm, right. was cool, collected. A quarter pounder, it was, what, $10? We're talking about $500 right now. Yeah, sir, you... sir! Wait, 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 then he gonna say, oh, yeah, you gotta pay the toll. I didn't call you. I got Geico, bitch! This is not Geico! <laughs> <laughs> I feel you. I feel you. She was like, bruh, stop playing with me. bitch. This is not I what they going to say. Oh, yeah, you got to pay the toll. I didn't call you. I got Geico, bitch. This is not Geico. <laughs> what the talk about we I got to pay. The fuck? Don't compare. Okay, Geico, Wait, don't, don't do it, sir. Don't do it. So, now that we're back. Bruh. Right now Easy with Yeah, hi. Should we? Tell him? <sighs> should we? We should tell him. I know, I know, guys. I know. You're probably read the title like, oh no. Oh no, they're moving. They're moving. Out of LA. Yeah, so we're probably going to be moving out of LA. You know, this is my awesome. hometown. This is where I'm from. But I think it's time, y'all. I think it's really time for us to get the step in. You know what I'm saying? We got to go. Yeah. It's time to get the fuck <laughs> ASAP <laughs> off this bitch. We're talking right. about her whole little aquarium whip in here. Uh, cause, cause tell them why, tell them why so, we gotta go. I mean, well, I don't live here, but yeah, I live here. Basically, so basically you what you whispering for? See, this uh, is why you leaving now. Yeah, cause, cause I you gotta whisper. whisper in my own courtyard, cause everyone gonna come out looking like. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, the reason why you gotta 
So a little drip drip right it's there. What just, happened? A little tea. A little tea. A little Ooh, tea. What you got? Okay. <laughs> Did you spill it? Literally. Wet t-shirt contest. <laughs> wow. So the reason why. <laughs> what's, what's up happening? I have something in my eye. Y'all see it? Let's go now, baby. I see it. I got it. I got it. Please look cute. Oh. Oh. Oh, God. Oh, is this why y'all want to me to watch it i don't know i went like super sonic there for a second but my tingles did it but this is is this why y'all wanted me to watch it is, is is it more of this in here is it more of this in here what's up what's up i have something in my eye y'all see it up, baby i see it i got it i got it yeah yeah blow on it yeah yeah natalie miss ain't nothing disney about was that a moan did you moan Let's listen one more time because the creep in me wants to hear them out again. I got it, I got it. Well, no. I don't know about you guys, but I heard it. Um, you <laughs> Why am I like this? I don't know. I don't know. Blame my mom and my dad and, you know. <laughs> I definitely heard that. Oh, oh god damn. <laughs> Tell them so what it is. the reason why mm -hmm. you didn't even blow in my eye. Um, it was blowing Max. in the hut. <laughs> my eye. Um, it was blowing in the hut. So the reason why is because I just felt like, you know what, I was actually thinking about staying here and I was going to pay way more money to get a three bedroom instead of a one because that's what I have now. And I was going to stay by myself and by yourself. have all the space in the world. Oh, yeah. But then I was like, wait a minute. They don't care about me? They don't care about me. No, they don't care about us. Oh, <laughs> He's just making it about her, bro. No, they don't care about us. Oh, not with the Michael Jackson. They don't really care about us. Who knows that song? Beat me, ate me, you can never break me, uh, 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 you can never kill me. I never, I never know. My brother knows the whole song, all the lyrics. All I want to say is that they don't really care about us. All I want to say is they don't really care about us. Yo, yo. <laughs> and my number's on the least too. I keep saying it because I'm, I'm really on the least. Yeah, she so, so to, <laughs> she's on the least. So to the least, like, okay, everybody. I got to tell them. Look. I got to yeah, she so to why you be odd? Because you be telling everybody. I gotta tell him. I gotta tell him. I be telling everybody when I walk around here. My name on the leash. <laughs> Just so you know, buddy. Just so you know. I should be charging you to say that. I should be charging you to say that. Nah, that. nah. Okay, let's get to the point. Let's get to the point. Okay. So the point is, y'all, like, I just feel like, you know, I want to be somewhere where I feel like people care about me. Don't, you know what I'm saying? Not just giving my money, spending my money. And if my car is parked somewhere too long in a place that I pay for. Right. It gets towed. Or you, you guys can just notify. Just a little notey. Oh, no, yeah. no. They did. I feel like, I definitely feel like they should have got a warning before a tow. And maybe there was a warning. I don't know. Easy and Natalie didn't say anything. But it doesn't sound like there was because Easy, Easy just said, yo, where was the notification? So for me, it's like, did I get a, did they get a warning on the car? Was there a note left on the car? Like, hey, if you guys don't move this car by such and such date, we will tow it. Why? I, I don't understand why that wasn't a first. Why wasn't that? Why that wasn't the first step? I know who texts their emails like that. I know, girl, text us. Text us. You know who we are. Or literally leave a note on the car for management. Like, it's not that hard. No, seriously, though, like, it's annoying because I feel like they worry about the wrong things here. We've literally have gotten our bikes stolen. I'm not just talking about regular, regular bikes. Electric bikes. Electric. Mm. Not no ET type shit. Oh, wow. We out here uh, on some <laughs> going type. 15 miles per hour exactly. on our electric bikes. Now they're gone. And guess what they told us? They said, hey, yo, call the popo, ho, call the popo. I'm yeah, like, they said, that's not my problem. Can we see the cameras? Actually, we have to respect the privacy of who. Wow, really? You got to respect the privacy. I can't even check the cameras for the garage for the date. Okay, cool. I will get the cops involved. See, I feel like, like, why even do all of that? Like, it's not even that deep, bro. Still on our bike. We got to respect So the basically, this whole video was just about poor customer service and the tingles. <laughs> Or customer service and the tingles. Respect my property. Yeah, so it like Facts. really like this is like really jokes aside. People stole our bikes and it was really unfortunate. And they told us to contact the police instead of having them do something about it. And of course, you guys already know the, the police, police didn't do nothing. Didn't do they, didn't do they got way too much to on their hands. Okay? Right, they got e bikes stolen. Yeah, so it's like ugh. yeah. Anyway, <laughs> the and e bikes.
e bikes. They got e bikes, bro. It's just they. So they my concerned. packages are always missing. Oh yeah, she got her packages stolen. It's not like, missing them. Missing it. It's missing it. It's always missing. It's, like, it's missing it. Like how? What are we in the ghetto? Like y'all just is bro still in the ghetto? Yes. Yeah, right. It does. And it's yet. not. You know, it, it's a pretty penny to live here. So yeah. it's just very frustrating. Yeah. So we've been talking. Yeah. Thinking. We're thinking. Wait, wait. Before you say it. Okay. I mean, they gonna put it together. But a year ago, we literally... You're so used to my little weird tendencies yeah, that you don't it. even react <laughs> But a year ago, we literally... You're so used to my little weird tendencies yeah, that you don't it. even react <laughs> All right, go ahead. You go ahead. You were talking. No, but you could tell them. What were you? I was going to say what you were thinking. Oh, that's so annoying. <laughs> no, 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 no. No, yeah, honestly, so pretty much, guys, like, we were thinking that's what you were going to say. Oh, okay. Yeah. We were thinking that it might be time to move, move in together. together. Mm -hmm. ah, this way y'all wanted me to watch it. Uh, uh, this way y'all wanted me to watch it. Is this why y'all want me to watch it? <laughs> As before I do my celebratory dance, you know, is this why y'all wanted me to watch it? That's dope. Saw it coming. I said this. I feel like they're, look, go back and watch my video. Anybody who's true to this and not new to this knows that I have, I predicted, I said that by 2022, I felt like they was going to be living together by 2023. Cause I did say uh, three years. I did say, I'm thinking engagement, not necessarily fully married yet, but definitely engaged. Um, Cause they've been, they, I, I, they I, like I said, they've been low key dating since they was best friends, dog. And to some of y'all, some of y'all think they be they been high key dating, so like not even trying to hide it, you know. Uh, so I think that this is great for them. And if they both feel ready, Natalie look like she ready, ready. Why? <laughs> Natalie look ready, ready. Easy look a little a little scared. But but that I feel like that's gonna change the content. I know that Easy basically stays over at Natalie's house um every night or whatever the case may be but i'm telling y'all it really does change it means something is different it's different even if you spend a night with this person every night at their house it's different when y'all get a place together that is jointly yours together i'm telling you i feel like the videos are going to be even more ridiculous between them and more cute and lovey-dovey and everything like that but i'm so happy guys I'm so happy. That's what's up, man. I love to see a couple uh, living and loving and experienced life and truly happy. You know what I'm saying? And that's what's up. I'm so, so happy for them, dog. I'm so happy for them. That's what's up. Moving together. together. Move. Say it. Which right. one? Move. <laughs> together. Move in together. Okay. Move in together. Move in together. Yeah, <laughs> I know. Last time we had this conversation was a year ago. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's crazy. And we didn't. And we, we like, were like, not ready. It was too soon. Mm -hmm. Way too soon. But now about it like look first of all we were best friends for three years yeah. low-key dating then together for a year it's, it's like dog years uh, i mean make it, it make, sense. make it make sense like what's the next step let's put the marriage no seriously though i think it's about that time you know what i'm saying wait like, wait agree. don't touch me <laughs> why <laughs> why <laughs> baby friend Oh, oh, I can't touch you for it. You want to just flip the rat. Yeah, that's what we were doing. If we I thought you wanted to live with me. I would be living with you. I thought you want to wake up to this face every morning. Oh, I mean, no, you kind of already do that, though. Baby. Right, that's, right. That's that's all. What? I mean, oh, no, you kind of already do that, though. Baby, I'm trying to cut costs. <laughs> that's, that's all I need to do. Cut costs. Oh, you know what? <laughs> I'm a cut. <laughs> No, so what? She not me. You tried to be me. No, I was gonna say something. It was gonna come off very violent. So I was like, mm -hmm. cut my neck off. Cut my neck off. Oh, come on. What you say? So it was gonna come off very violent. So I was like, mm -hmm. cut my neck off. Cut my neck off. <laughs> I don't know what she like, said, but I think either I way, we've been thinking about it. So we might be going like house shopping or whatever. I think it's about that time. House shopping. Yeah, let us know what you guys think. House shopping. Oh, I would love to follow y'all on that journey. First of all, fun fact about me: I love to drive around and look at houses. Like that's the thing that I do to relax. <clears throat> I just love looking at houses. I, I love architecture. I love uh, decor and stuff like that. So I like to drive around and look at the stuff like that. But 
that's what's up. I hope they really do keep take us along on that journey. Like, I hope they'll just pop up. You know what I'm saying? Because it would be fun to watch them go along the journey and find that right house. You know what I'm saying? And even have Neezy Gang, because I know they love to include you guys, have Neezy Gang um, maybe even vote on, like, the top three houses or something like that. That'd be dope. Think you guys think it's too soon? It's it's been time. Let us know in the comment section. We love reading. It's been time. It's here. You know where I'm at. We are scared. We need a little courage. We need courage. Oh. She's annoying. She's so annoying. No. Bro, no. I be ready. To... Y'all to practically live together no, let me for do the that. last six years. Y'all gonna report so. this channel. <laughs> Uh, make sure you guys like and subscribe. We're super excited about this. Let us know what you guys think. If you guys are going through this with your friend or your lover, or whatever. Not your friend. Like your friend. Like your friend. 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 Your That's out of pocket. It's nice and warm. Nice and warm. Okay. Easy your food. That's what's up, though. Um, like I said, y'all, I am very hopeful that they will take us along on this journey. I'm very happy for them. And now I see why, y'all. It was a hidden gem in this. Guys, I will never let me. Y'all know me. I'm going to always be authentic. I'm going to always be unsolicited. I'm going to always be truthful. Let me apologize. Right? Let me apologize um to the Neezy gang for suspecting and thinking <clears throat> that y'all was leading me down uh 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 a dead a dead end okay uh y'all did y'all came through this this was worth it I, I this was this definitely had a hidden gem in it and i appreciate y'all for suggesting it with that being said what's all this extra stuff they got 15 seconds but ain't number darkness okay <laughs> i'll just be checking because y'all be yelling at me i'll be scared y'all got me traumatized um <laughs> with that being said solicit nation if you guys enjoyed this reaction as much as i enjoy giving it to you please be pause please be sure to like comment and subscribe down below don't be afraid to share make sure you hit that notification bell so you can be notified every single time i upload and if you've been here before then you already know i gotta hit y'all with this <laughs>